Hello, I'm LaDonna Boyd, bringing you the lesson for June 21st, 2020, and I want to start by saying Happy Father's Day. On behalf of RH Boyd, we want to honor and acknowledge all the fathers out there. We thank you for all that you do. I also want to encourage everyone to check out the content from the Vision Conference last week. The session was enlightening and uplifting, and we are grateful to those who support this endeavor. You can see more at www.visionconference.org. The lesson for today is entitled Wisdom's Rewards, and it comes from Lesson 12 from the Adult Christian Life Sunday School and Small Group Study Guide from R.H. Boyd. The scriptural reference is Proverbs chapter 8. And over the past few weeks, we've talked about the importance of wisdom as exhibited in the book of Proverbs. Chapter 8 is regarded as one of the most difficult yet insightful chapters in the book. It encourages the reader to continue to choose wisdom. Wisdom is the path of Christ, and in him all the treasures of hope and knowledge lie. From a human perspective, it seems as though wisdom can be fleeting. Foolishness can be disguised as wisdom if we do not vet those from whom we seek guidance. We are always to seek wise counsel, and it is important to make sure that we acknowledge the people that God puts in our lives. We often meet wisdom through the people that we encounter. Looking at the teachings of the New Testament, we can see how Jesus Christ personified wisdom. Wisdom says that silver and gold are nothing compared to the working value of being wise. And we are to choose wisdom over earthly riches because it offers skills for those who are able to receive it, such as prudence, knowledge, and discernment. As it says in Proverbs chapter 8, verses 17 through 21, I love those who love me and those who seek me find me. Riches and honor are with me, enduring wealth and prosperity. My fruit is better than gold, even fine gold, and my yield than choice silver. I walk in the way of righteousness, along the paths of justice, endowing with wealth those who love me and fill their treasuries. As we can see, wisdom is so important in every single endeavor in our life. Wisdom despises and hates pride and arrogance. Consider a time when your various pursuits were led by wisdom versus the time that it was led by selfishness. How did those decisions impact your education, your family, your career, and others? What would you have done differently? By walking in wisdom, we set ourselves on the path to an abundant life. Again, I'm LaDonna Boyd, and I hope that you've enjoyed this lesson. Check out the entire lesson in the Adult Christian Life available at www.rhboyd.com or on Amazon.com. And don't forget to like, share, and comment below.